what's good everybody and for this video i'm going to be showing y'all how you can be able to save this fib badge and as well as the iaa badge onto any of your saved outfits on gta so the first thing we're going to need to do is come to your arcade and you need to finish the setups first then we're going to come over to this board over here and that picture where you see lester at you want to click on that mission if y'all are not wearing this suit when you leave out of your arcade you just want to restart your game and just do it again but once you do have the suit we're just going to make our way to this specific gun store and we're going to come over to the outfits and you want to equip the outfit that you want to add the badge on so then you're going to make it over to this location and you're just going to take everybody out and then just look for the guy that has the FIB badge and once you take it off of him it's going to pop up right on your clothing. Alright y'all so then we're going to come back over to this gun store again. We're just going to come to this location just so that we can be able to save our outfit and once y'all do that we can go ahead and we can leave this mission. And once y'all get back into the lobby, you will notice that you have your FIB badge still on. And now, let's just go ahead and move on to the next one. Now, for our IAA badge, we're going to have to go to Playlist, then go to Create, go to Stunt Races, and add the first stunt race that's at the top. Now, we're going to go to the bottom and save that playlist. Now, we're just going to go to My Playlist, and then we're just going to click on that mission that we just added to the playlist. If the mission says ULP counterintelligence, it means you're doing it right. And so pretty much now, y'all, all we're going to do is just get in this car and we're just going to go to any location that our apartment is. And we're just going to go ahead and go there so that we can save this outfit. And so after you finish saving your outfit, you can just go ahead and pick up your phone and you can just leave the mission. And that's how you can get both of the badges on GTA. I hope this video helped y'all out. Hit that like and subscribe if it helps. And I will be seeing y'all next time.